Hello everyone, my name is Jesse Juderia. For today, I will going to report about the condition before common era. So, the human condition before common era are early ancestors free mal need to survive February, the inventions of several developments. Gifted with brains more advanced than other creatures, humans are able to utilize abundant materials for their own ace and comfort. As it is difficult to pinpoint the particular period where the technology is said to have started, one can say, at the very least, the motivations to make things easier has been around since humans are homo erectus have been using to fire to cook through clipping and plant over the other to produce a spark, all the while without realizing the loss of friction and heat. So, as we all know, uh, the life before is very different to what we have today. So, how they live before without technology? So, our ancestors are gifted with the brains that, uh, that are more advanced than any other creatures which allows them to utilize things in their environment for their survival. So, Homo erectus, they discovered fire and have been using it to cook food and by clipping stones, uh, they produce fire without realizing the loss of friction and the heat. So, ayun guys, uh, for this um, topic, and the next is about the uh, tools from stones and plink mark the era of the stone age during the advent of our very own homo sapiens and humans began to sharpen stone as one would a knife. An example of this is a simple machine called weights. So soon enough, people discovered minerals and began forging metalwork. They realized that these substances are more durable, malleable, and have more luster than the previous materials. They began to cover themselves of our necessity and gradually added several more to their garments. Some of those found at excavation sites are reminiscence of early ancestors suggestion that our ancestors have been deeply engaged in the concept of beauty perhaps they have taken a linking to a certain shiny stone or perfectly shaped bone and wanted to wear it as a trophy so uh homo sapiens they develop a weapons used for hunting the weapons are mainly by sharpening stones the example is this is the simple machine called wedge and also they created hammer and the axe and later on they discovered minerals and began forging metal and for work and the example is copper copper and tin mixed together to create bronze tools they realized these substances uh, are more durable and malleable than the previous materials which is the stones so next is uh, about a uh, religion. So I, I I will not uh, read na kasi um, mahaba na siya. So I will explain na lang what what I learned about this slide. So they worship so many kinds of um deities or primitive primitive gods, elephants and mammoths out by their size and worship as the owner of the land and asking blessing and their hunting ground so on the contrary they might um we will use might as a word because uh this is a pass uh how can i say possibility that the people uh they are making observation and uh inspiration before so they will quote that is used for ancestors garments and meats for their food and also they have the de- de- uh, huh? sorry they have different gods for for each place so the first is and placed near mountains uh yung 
they might have a mountain god to explain them wine currents and ask for the provision. So, second is that in the near of the bodies of the water, they might have a water god asking for a good catch when they are fishing. So, throughout the course of the history, religions become contender to science. Uh, how can I say? Agwad Liju, it's a being the most easily grasped. So, that's all for today po. Uh, thank you.